Hey guys, welcome back to the Parkiverse. This week, as a little surprise, I thought I'd bring you guys a follow up to the Attack on Titan Levi setup. This time, for the Attack Titan Wielding Eren. This is going to be another one in my series on how to customize your home screen like a pro. A series where I show you how you can easily and quickly get these stunning minimalistic setups on your Android phones. So if you haven't already, make sure you check out the previous episodes. And following that format, I'm going to show you how you can take a basic home screen setup and turn it into something like this. But before we get started, if you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure you like and subscribe to help support the channel. And don't forget to submit your live wallpaper and home screen requests right from within the Epic Live Wallpaper app. Just head to the live section and then click on the request button. And remember to boost your favorite ones using both the heart and the booster buttons here. So here he is, Eren with the menacing attack titan forming right behind him. This is definitely one of my most favorite home screen setups of the year thus far. With a bold music widget at the bottom of the screen, our most used social media on the right, essentials on the left, and this extra thick date and time indicator which has been modified to also show our battery level. This setup will be running Nova Launcher using KWGT widgets and to complete the look I'll be using the Hex Installer for system wide customization. The link for these and everything else that you're going to need are going to be in the description below. Now as a quick note, if you want that full screen edge to edge look for your home screen setup without those ugly signal bars then make sure you disable the notification bar within Nova Launcher settings. And to get this comfy icon layout Make sure to head to Nova's home screen settings and change the grid size to 5 across and 10 down. And to really clean up your home screen, I highly recommend you turn off icon labels, increase your icon size, as well as disabling your home screen dock. Now that we have that out of the way, the icon pack that we're using in this setup to stand out from that dark backdrop is the Weekons icon pack. Just simply head to Nova's look and feel section and set the pack as your system icons. And before we go any further, make sure you grab this unique wallpaper from my very own custom creation app. Just simply head to the live video section and you'll find it there. And remember, if you have any wallpaper suggestions of your own, make sure to let me know from right within the app itself and boost the ones that you want to see next. Next up, these awesome KWGT widgets. Starting with the bottom of the screen, this bold music player from one of my favorite packs is number 84 from the mini music player pack. Just simply load it to your home screen, then resize and reposition it. For a quick guide on KWGT manipulation, make sure you check out the video in the top right corner. And once you're happy with the look, let's move on to the second widget. Indicating the date and time is this stylistic setup courtesy of the Hulk pack, 333, which we're going to alter ever so slightly, adding in that battery level indicator behind the clock. So let's start once again by loading in a KWGT layout to our home screen and adjusting the widget's size and positioning, just like we did in the first widget. And once done, let's add in our battery indicator. For this, we're simply going to use the plus button in the top right corner to add in a new progress item. By default, this is going to be set up to show your battery level. So all we have to do is head into it and adjust its size and height so it's almost perfectly overlapping the original rectangle shape. Now all that's left to do is to head back to the item listing and drag the progress item higher in the list, placing it behind the original text items. Now, make sure to hit save. And wrapping up this setup, we're using Hex Installer. This is going to give you a nice AMOLED friendly black backdrop with the colors of the theme splashed across the whole system including the notification panel. Just use the color codes that I'm showing on screen. And alternatively, you can get a similar result using the app One Shade. If you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure you like and subscribe to help support the channel. And if you have any theme suggestions or requests, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. See you next time on Into the Parkiverse.